This weekend, you can celebrate art and food at the Hermosa Inn. Love it, that place. Yeah, it's the Palette to Palette Art Retreat. It's a three-day event that offers some really cool workshops throughout the weekend. So Jamie's at the Hermosa Inn in Paradise Valley to explain. Good morning. Good morning, guys. I got to start with, you know what? I am not going for this Instapot thing. You guys are all on board for it because, you know what? We have executive chefs right here in the Valley of the Sun. They know how to cook us up some good food. So why learn when we have the professionals right here? So I want to tell you about palette to palette. So palette like what you eat and then palette like what you paint. This is a, a three-day event that's happening Friday, Saturday, and Sunday right here at Lanza at Hermosa Inn. Uh, Carrie is the artist that will be leading the way for us. You've been painting some 30 years right here in the Valley. Uh, tell me about this event. Well, tomorrow we're having a plein air event, which means that everybody that comes out, you can, we take total beginners, and I'll show them what kind of equipment, how the oil paints work, and they'll do a little study of a little venue around or uh, just some flowers around the property. Carrie, I heard something about mimosas. Okay, now on Saturday at 2.30, we're gonna have an event where you can come and paint and I'll take you through it step by step with acrylic paintings and you'll take it home, um, finished piece of a little Santa Fe uh, uh, door. Oh, wait, and if, I don't know if you can yeah, see this, Mike Williams. Yeah. We have it down here as I knock over your entire stand here. We've got this right here and then of course you're working on a beautiful painting of our iconic Camelback Mom. That's right. It's one of my favorite uh, places to paint is here at the Hermosa and then looking at the beautiful Camelback. We've got a great view from the Hermosa Inn. It is gorgeous. Well, I know you are probably working up an appetite and I just am in general. Uh, so let's talk to Chef Jeremy because we're talking about the fall foods and this has a beautiful dinner involved that is sold out. But you have a recipe that we can make at home and this is going to be delicious for us. Yeah, we've got our harvest dinner. Justin Beckett from Beckett's Tables joining us for this dinner, and we're celebrating some of our local, favorite local farmers. We've got Wendell Crow from Crow's Dairy and produce from Bob McClendon. So we're going to be incorporating their products into every dish on the menu. Just focused on everything we can get locally from these. What dishes. is this right here? So this is, uh, we're making a kabocha squash soup. It's a Japanese pumpkin we get from Bob McClendon. Um, so you're going to want to just cut that in half, scoop it out, and then uh, we place that on a sheet pan of salt and pepper and roasted it for about a half hour at um, 350 degrees. So it's a real simple recipe. So I'm gonna take just a couple shallots here, some olive oil in the pan. And we're gonna have the recipe on our website. I'll let you continue because I wanna talk to Wendell real quick with Crow's Dairy. And Wendell, we were talking about these cheeses that you make and they're gonna be part of this dinner that's happening. And it's a surprise even for you when you come and taste what the chef has done with your work. Oh, it is, it's fantastic. It's, it's like a whole new flavor. It's like, like I said before, it's like things you've always eaten but completely different. It's like, wow, wow, what did you do with that? <laughs> and without chefs like, like Jeremy, uh, buying local, we, would, we wouldn't exist. Uh, we can, there's, Tons of cheese out there, mega cheese places that get milk from 350 dairies. We're able to control our product, make a fantastic product. They can't compete with my quality. I can't compete with their price. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so Wendell's got Crow's Dairy. We've got Bob and Bob McClendon's vegetables. And then, of course, we have Chef Jeremy, who is making up such be beautiful, beautiful things for you, including, what is this? The so fried squash up, we, blossom yeah, and that's all we have time for chef so okay. we're gonna have the recipe online so folks can do that but you can always just come by and uh, have lunch on the veranda here because it is stunning and of course a beautiful day it is season here in valley of the sun back to you